I'm late. Wait, wrong video. Yo guys, what's up? It's your boy HA and today we're back with another banger. This is the first episode of the Travis Scott Truck Series. I'm gonna be completely transforming my full Ranger into something you guys and me have never seen before. It's gonna be a UK first, world first, universe first, you name it, it's a first. We've got the wrap sat inside there, which I'm gonna get out in a minute. If you haven't seen that, was in my last video, well, it was two videos ago. We're going for a chocolatey satin brown wrap. This is our first time wrapping a car. I've actually got help from my girlfriend's brother today, a good friend of mine, Harrison. So this is his first time on a YouTube channel, guys, so look forward to it. And it won't be the last, definitely, for sure. We're gonna do our best and see how it goes. So it's been a childhood dream of mine to wrap a car. Let's get it. So I'm just gonna get H to move the BMW back over there. So we've got a nice big arena here. Woo! Listen to the sound of that. So we've got a nice big arena here. I'm going to pull the truck here so we're out of the wind as much as possible. And then we're going to run an extension lead there for the heat gun. So I'm going to pull the truck here. I have never wrapped a car before. I don't know really how to do it. I spent my last four nights watching endless amounts of YouTube videos. So proof's in the pudding. Let's see how it goes. See, this is a squeegee. This is one of the tools of the trade. It's all about the pressure. It's all about the firm pressure. A lot of people make the mistake of being too delicate with it. It's all about the pressure. So we're gonna start on the bonnet. First thing is I've got to get the bonnet as clean as possible to make sure there's no blemishes under the wrap. This is where Waterless comes into play. This video is sponsored by Waterless. Waterless is a clean and protect spray that you can use on any car, motorbike, van, lorry, and it doesn't just provide a beaded finish and a great clean, it also protects the car and will last for around two weeks in between washes. So this is perfect if you're just in between washes, you haven't got time to get to the car wash and you wanna make your car spanking for a car show or just cause you're taking the missus out for a bit of dinner, this is the tool for you. And it smells like you can drink it. Wait, can you drink it? No, you can't drink it. Don't try that at home, kids. I'm a professional, I'm a professional. Anyway, so I'm gonna apply a nice amount of waterless on there, as you can see, and with my microfiber, I'm gonna go over it like that. Instantly dry, and honestly, the beads are insane. So thank you to Waterless for sponsoring this video. Use the code up here, and follow the link in the description. Get yourself a package, and you will not be disappointed. I think these should be essential, like keeping your aftershave in the glove box. You should keep one of these in the glove box as well, lads and ladies. I was actually inspired to do this. I was sitting down watching Matt Armstrong wrap his M4 and it made me want to do it myself and give it a go. I'm going to get the wrap out and show you it. Love a bit of manual labour. Yep, straight down. It's my first try guys, good luck to me. <laughs> Satisfaction. <laughs> Got the heat gun, extension lean plugged in, ready to start on the bonnet. So without further ado guys, this is the first panel. Let's see how it goes. Should we start from this end? Well it's not clamped down. You peel from here, pull it. Right, see, pull it so it's flat. How much does that look in the middle? Stand in the middle of the car. Yeah, pull it. That's, that's it, it, pull it. That's it, that's it, that's it. And then just lay like that. There we go. Is that flat now? Can it go? Yep. But like pretty hard. But you just want to pull it so in opposite direction. Yeah, but look, look where I'm, like I'm up, like off the car. You're just going to look at it, make sure it's glassy like that. It and lay it down. That's it. And pull. Try and go like that on the see like go a bit wider on the corner. 
make it look get tension from flat. both that's, sides. That's it. And lay like that. Yeah. Go on, get that. No, that's, that's all right. Let that go, let that go. That's it. Right, make sure it looks glassy. There we go. Lay it down. That's better. I'm professionals at this now. I feel like Sammy. Up. See what you're doing there. You're you're able to push all the air up and get rid of it. This bit in here, where it goes into an indent, up here, it's still part of the bonnet. Got ya. All that just come out. Move that a little bit underneath it. Like criminal. You see, I don't know if these methods are orthodox, but they're working, all right. So. One hour later. Well, that didn't go to plan. Oh, cocky bollocks! Got it completely wrong. I held the heat gun too close to the wrap. Uh, completely my fault, and it ripped. So, good job ordered 25 meters because we're going to need every single millimeter of it. But look, you live and learn. God loves a triad, doesn't he? Keep trying, people. Pull it, pull it. Instead of throwing this bit away for the bonnet, we're just reheating it, getting it back to getting it back to perfect, and then we're gonna use it on a wheel arch. On the fender for the USA. Why is that waterless? Because I sprayed it with it. Yeah. You sprayed. Hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. <laughs> if it wrinkles, don't use the squidgy. Mate, let you do the squidgy and I'll do the holding, yeah? Alright. Some s <laughs> that's it. I want the world to know. Guys, look at this. First panel is nearly completed. I have actually done a lot of holding. Uh, I'm not very good with the squeegee, so I'm letting H take the reins and uh, steady the ship. But he's nearly there. He's nearly there. Nearly there. We're, what we're going to do is we're changing the plan of attack. So instead of going for the bonnet and the big panels, we're going to get the doors done, or the back two doors first. Then maybe the front doors or the wings, and then we're gonna leave the back, the bumpers and like the rear quarters and the bonnet for a little bit later on. Tonight it's getting a bit late, so we might get one more door in or maybe two in if we're lucky. But that'll be that for today. So I'm gonna jump back in and help him touch some naughty little montages. <sighs> This is so therapeutic. It's a joke. So guys, we have got this door wrapped. It's the first full panel that's wrapped. We might rewrap it again at the end, depending on how it looks, but it looks pretty decent if you ask me. Just before I show you, we're getting the door handle on so you can see the complete package. Thanks for watching the video. This is a new series turning my truck into Travis Scott Cactus Jack going all out So I hope you like it. Please hit that subscribe button hit the like button Let's smash a thousand likes this video quicker. I get to 27k. We can do a new giveaway If you haven't seen I'm doing a giveaway for a pair of Jordan 4 retro blues on my Instagram now Go on there follow the link in the description Give me a follow on Instagram and check out what you got to do They could be yours absolutely free and I'll be doing a live draw on my Instagram Graham, in my Instagram. Oh, my balls haven't dropped. My voice, I still ain't got my voice back from the England game. Oh, Jesus! I can't wait to show you guys this. I actually like the door handles like that. It looks good for some reason. Three, two, one. Bosh, look at that. 
I love it. I absolutely love it. We're going satin black handles, tinted black windows. So just picture what it's going to look like in your head. Blacking all this out. That is going to look unbelievable, especially with the white wheels, guys. Comment below what you guys think. What do you think of our first attempt wrapping? Is there anything we can improve on? Leave everything, all your feedback below. I'll answer all of your comments. See you guys next time for episode two of the Travis Scott Truck Series.